Okay, it's first day of school at 6.42. My alarm went off at 6. We were all still awake. Allie and Jax were still awake at almost 1. I'm going to feel bad waking them up in like 15 minutes. Where's the sweatshirt you had on? Oh, okay, just grab one quick. Um, I was looking at my mirror. Like, I did this before. I had like a tiny white dot. So I used little tools and stuff to try and get this white dot that was like buried under my skin. I got it, but now I've got this. Anyway, I'm going to feel so bad waking them up because they were literally awake. It was like 12.40. They're going to be so tired today. And I told Jax, I said, hey, I said, in kindergarten, you don't have nap time. I thought he was going to be so excited. He's like, oh, but I'm going to be so tired. I said, well, you can take a nap after school. Because the way they have it, the kindergarten boys start today, just the boys. And then tomorrow is just the girls. And then Thursday is just the boys. And then Friday is just the girls. Well, the, my girls have school and I have work. So tonight, I would take Jax to my mom's and he'll spend the night at my mom's tonight and hang out with her tomorrow. And then Thursday night after his second day of school, because then he'll come home Wednesday. Yeah, he'll come home tomorrow after everybody's home from school. I'll go pick him up. And then he'll go to bed early and get up for school Thursday. And then after Thursday evening, I'll take him back to my mom's he'll spend the night there and hang out with her on Friday. I think they're taking Nanny to get her hair done and to the store or something. I don't know. And then Friday, I'll go get him after school. But it's like, what a pain. I think they usually start on Wednesday and like the boys do Wednesday, the girls do Thursday and then Friday is all of them together. But this year we start on Tuesday. So it's boys. Hold on. I will. When you got your shoes on, boys only, then girls only, boys only, then girls only. Then it'll be the weekend. And then it'll be all of them together next Monday. So they go to school for that whole week, all of them. And then they have the next Monday off because it's Labor Day. It's like, oh my gosh. So yeah, Adri's finishing getting ready. It's 6.44 a.m. Like I said, I have to wake the little ones up at 7. <sighs> oh, my neck. I'm super tired. And I was like up late because my kids wouldn't go to sleep, so I couldn't go to sleep. 6.40 and it was 12.40. Oh my God, it's only been six hours and I've already been awake for like 40 minutes. Sorry, my alarm just went off. So I ate like a donut, a full-size glazed donut, and then I was snacking on cheeses while it was on the computer. So I woke up my stomach. I kind of have a stomach ache. But it's just I shouldn't have eaten, especially right before. But I wasn't even hungry. I think it was like nerve snacking. So yeah, Adriel will be getting on the bus here anytime. I think this year she gets on the bus like 10 minutes later. I don't know. She needs to hurry up and not wait till the last minute because if she misses the bus, her dad's going to take her to school because I have to get the little ones up and ready. Where last year, if she missed the bus, it wasn't a big deal. I had to drive to that town anyway. I don't have to do that this year. If she doesn't want to be late on her first day of school. So I'll get her off to school. And then a couple minutes later, I'll have to wake up the little ones. <clears throat> it was so cute last night. Jack's like, Mom, remember? We have to get up early and put Paw Patrol on. And we'll watch that, and then we get in the car and drive to school. Because, like, that was our routine. I'm like, yeah, buddy, I don't even know if Paw Patrol's on at that hour. We'll have to find out tomorrow. <laughs> so I have Nick Jr. on right now. It's SpongeBob. And here, in, like, 15 minutes, it'll turn to Paw Patrol. So he can sit on the couch and watch Paw Patrol. And Allie wants to go to school early because they're serving donuts today for the first day for breakfast. My eyelash itches. So she wants to go early so they can have breakfast at school. And then she can take Jax into the cafeteria so she can show him how to how to do the whole line and everything in the cafeteria. So when he goes at lunch, he'll have a little bit of an idea because he went through first with his big sister. So yeah, she wants to go have breakfast this morning. So I'll check in later. Alright, there's Adri. Ready to go. First day of school. Because fifth grade, the bus was like empty. And this year it's gonna be like full. Super cute. My shoes. I love my shoes so much. I do too. They're super cute. All right. Have a great first day of seventh grade. Her last year at the middle school. Adri's getting on the bus. Uh, her last year at the middle school. I can't believe it. So while I was outside taking Adri's picture, this little guy woke up on his own. So he's down here, huh? Good morning. Happy first day of kindergarten. <laughs> we're all so tired. Like I said, we were all up so late we just couldn't sleep. 
too excited. So, uh, Adri took her bracelet off last night and seriously just put it on the chair. <sighs> Alright, get the windows open. Her curtains, I mean. Everything's clean. It's so nice. Allie Buckers. Allie Buckers, it's morning. It's morning time. It's your first day of second grade. She asked me last night, she's like, Mom, how do you wake me up in the morning? What the heck, where's Allie? <laughs> oh, you little shit. She snuck out of bed at some point and got a chocolate bar last night. No wonder you couldn't sleep. You had chocolate right at bedtime. <laughs> Let's not do that anymore, okay? Let's not sneak out of bed and get snacks. <sighs> I said they had Jay's down here. It's time to get up. It's 7 o'clock. Adri just left for school. Adri just got on her bus. Colton didn't get on the bus, so hopefully... He didn't miss it. Hopefully he has a ride. Hi, you. Good morning. It's your first day of second grade. Jax woke up on his own. He's already out here on the couch. Do you want to bring your blanket? You come out and you can get dressed and have a blanket. Are you so excited? Ellie has a super wiggly tooth. She's probably going to lose her, lose her tooth on her first day of school. Allie's coming out, and we'll I'll wipe this board off. And we'll put your stuff on it, okay? Bouncy houses. When we go when there's the cake wheel and stuff. That's Eric going in the car. That's the gym. Remember, they have bouncy houses set up oh. on that one day, the school car school carnival, and then you like we're throwing the balls in that thing. Oh. Yeah, that's the gym. Here you go. Off to school. Ugh, it's chilly out this morning. It's only like 51. Okay. I'm not crying. I just, I just dropped Allie and Jax off and <laughs> she, I got him out and I gave him both a hug and she grabbed his hand and she had her arm around him and she was taking her brother up and they were walking up and I said, bye guys. And they turned around and waved and uh, my last baby is off to kindergarten. I told myself, I'll see you in just a little bit. Uh, so he's, He's scared. I said, don't be scared. I said, Allie will be there. I said, she'll show you where to go. I said, mommy will be there. Sorry, I'm just... <laughs> oh, now I get to go home and hang out for a couple hours till I have to go to work. I have to go in a half hour early this week. <sighs> oh my gosh. It's tough. It's tough letting go, guys. <laughs> okay, it's 8 a.m. I'm home. We don't need this on. It's 67 in here. <laughs> Cause it's just cold. It was cold outside. It's only in the fifties. Anyways, it's 8 a.m. I'm back home. Gonna chill out for a little bit. But now that we're back into school routine, I want to get back into intermittent fasting. So I, like I said I ate a bunch last night. Look at this ridiculous thing. I ate a bunch of like a donut and then a bunch of Cheez-Its last night right before bed, which. I'm feeling it this morning. Oh, she did turn her TV off. Good job, Adri. Um, so today, because I, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I work at the schools and the cafeterias and the kitchen or whatever. So I work from 10.15 to 1.15. So I think I will just, sorry, breath, not eat anything till after work and either bring home something from work or eat at home. I'm so out of breath. So my first meal of the day will be at like 1.30. But I don't know, because I'll be getting up at 6 to get Adri up. So I go from, I don't know, I've got to start going to bed earlier too. But yeah, I'm going to get back into intermittent fasting. 
I know a lot of you were asking if I was going to do my eat in the car after, after work videos. I'm not because I won't be in my car. Because I transferred to a different place. But I'm still going to have to eat lunch every day. But for now, I'm just going to relax. Until I have to start getting ready for work. Successful first day of school morning. And everybody's going to sleep good tonight. He's going to be so tired. And Jax will sleep at my mom's house because he doesn't have school tomorrow. Um, even though Jay's home, like we made the plans when he had a job. So, and I asked him, I was like, oh no. She's like, we, I've been counting on him coming over and he's been excited to go stay at Nana's. Um, so yeah, I will check in later. <sighs> I hope they have a good day. <laughs> I think Adrian got on the wrong bus this morning. Just, I don't know. We'll have to find out the deal when she gets home. But the bus stop to pick him up. But it was the same thing last year. So then they switched their bus. So I told her, I text her. I'm like, I don't even know what bus you should ride home then. The one that picked you up or the one that you're supposed to ride. And Jax has never been on a bus before. And today he'll ride the bus home. Like, what a big day. <laughs> what a big day for my little buddy. I'll have to remember to enclose pictures I took this morning. But, all right. I'm going to, actually, I'm going to go upload pictures. <sighs> Of their first day. I changed my pocket. But I'm gonna put my glasses on so I can see better on my phone. Alright, I'll check in later. Here comes the bus. Jack has never rode the bus before. <laughs> <laughs> Jax is Allie's little brother. Yeah, he's never been on a bus before either. So this is his first time. Hi, buddy. Hi, Allie. They are going to be doing construction over there, and they have cut the way all across over here. Okay. And then that way, I know there's. Okay. Okay. Hi, guys. Jax, you rode on the bus for the first time. How was it? Oh yeah, when you cross the railroad tracks, you have to be quiet. Where's your sweatshirt? It's okay. Where's your sweatshirt? Is it in your bag? Yeah. Yeah. What are you trying to tell me? Your socks? What? They smell good. They smell good. No way, Jose. I don't want to smell those stinking things. Get them out of here. Careful. Careful. Don't land on Allie. <laughs> Oh He's rotten. <laughs> All right. Allie and Jax are going to greet Adri, and Kyler's going to greet Colton. <laughs> Colton's hanging out. His parents aren't home, so he's over here hanging out. <sighs> There's Adri. There's Colton. <laughs> so, what did you learn about your voices? They should be at what? A zero, oh, and, but if you're in the hallway, it should be a zero, and if you're in your classroom, it should be one, but if it's two, that means when you have a group, when a, a reading group, you talk, but three is for outside. Okay. And then, the so next... Usually zero is no talking, okay. one's whisper, yeah. two is normal. Okay. And then the next thing, we learn around. how to be responsible and kind and uh race responsible responsible respectful is that one of them responsible respectful and kind Did yeah safe just let her don't no. ask her questions okay. let her let her tell us okay and then it's okay she's just... actually we did do the pledge <gasps> you did the pledge of allegiance yeah in the <gasps> classroom because the flag wasn't up yet oh they didn't have the flag up outside yeah because it they it was the first day of school. And they didn't have that. Oh, so you, so you said the Pledge of Allegiance in your classroom. Do you know how it goes? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation. One nation. One nation under God, indivisible. With and liberty and justice for all. <laughs> yeah, good job. You okay. remembered. And then uh, the next thing we did was uh, uh, she was t 
teaching us we, the, our morning work. Yeah. Your morning work? Yeah. That's Jax's. Wait, <laughs> My morning work is my border. Right, just let it go. Let her toss it on her Here. Oh, what is that? That was my morning work. Happy got... first day of second grade. That's Oh, that was your morning work today? Yeah. And then we got to draw something on the back and I drew a pink house. Okay. And then the next thing that I did was uh, we got we got, got to use the restroom and get a drink. Mm -hmm. And we had to line up on the wall and then we went back in the classroom. And after that, she read a story to us. She and said, you're finally here. Oh, yeah, that's what the story was? Yeah. Was and, it a good story? Yeah. Did and, you get to sit on the carpet? Did you guys sit on the carpet while she wait, read it? That was, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Oh, you didn't do that? <laughs> okay, then I, I did something else before I went to lunch. So she didn't read a story or she did later? Oh, she did later. Oh, she did that. Okay. I did this. Jax, what, what is that? that? I made a story about school <gasps> stuff. So what? first. School rules? Yeah. Oh, cool. So first, there's a classroom. Follow directions. Be responsible. We be respectful to th to things and others. Good job. What are two hallway rules? Be quiet on z Zorazzo. On Terrazzo? Yeah. I know what that it means. What does that mean? The hallway. Oh, does it? Yeah, that's like the material that's on the board. Yeah. And then oh. walk with hands on to your side. Good job. And then... What? Cafeteria. Can you talk into that real quick? <laughs> okay. and then he wants to talk for you real quick. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Allie's telling me about her school day. Jackson, no, no, she's telling me about her school day. Why are two cafeteria No. Time, Let Adri do it. Let Adri do it. <laughs> Okay, don't do that. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay. Stay in your bubble. Stay in your bubble. Okay. Talk quietly and use manners. Allie just tipped over. One of two school bus rules. Stay in your seat. Talk quietly. Okay, good job. What of two playground rules. Play fair and be a good friend. Three... What? Whistles? Whistles. Wait, three whistles means line up quickly and quietly. Good job. That was the rules you learned today? Yeah. Yeah. And then... Oh, did you learn that too? Three whistles mean... What does three whistles mean? You need to line up. When you're on the playground? Good job, buddy. Down! Okay. <laughs> then... Oh, I went to lunch. And, and what happened at lunch? I lined up and I saw mom cleaning the dishes. <laughs> and then I went inside and she told us, told me to lift my pretzel coat up so they know what it is. Oh, yeah. Cause and someone... I scoot over there and mom said, what did, what happened with, did ja anything happen with Jax? And I said, yeah. I And I also said, uh. Jax was sad when he had to go sit in his line. And uh, I was sad too. I was lonely. And he he was crying in, in, the, uh, in, the, gym in the gym. And, and then, then we left. No, left. and then what did mom point out that you forgot on your tray? What did you forget to grab? Milk. Yeah, you <laughs> and Nira. <laughs> You guys both had to go over and get your milks. Yeah, and then I went to... Who did you see when you dumped your tray in the trash and set your tray up to get washed? <laughs> and, <laughs> and then, and then uh, I... Wait, after lunch, was it recess? Yeah, and at okay. recess, it was my best time ever. I I had, I had spent time with Andy and Ellie, and we did flip. You did? You got to play with Andy and Ellie? And we learned how to do a cartwheel on a balance beam, and Yay! I did it. You did not do a cartwheel on a balance beam. I, you no, would have hurt no, yourself. I did it on a low, a low 
Maybe on a line, yeah. on a line on the ground. Because yeah. I know you didn't do a cartwheel on the actual balance beam out there. You would have wiped out. Jack, I Ellie's trying to tell me something. But, not like and then after but you and Andy and Ellie played together? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. She, uh, this, the teacher, she, she, she read a story. You're finally here, and then it said, "You're finally here. You're finally here. Yeah, you're finally here. You're finally here." <laughs> and then after she was done reading the story, we went. She said, and then we worked on this other project. Just. Don't make Rex break Buzz's helmet. She told oh my gosh. you. <laughs> to she, she told me. She didn't tell me anything. She, oh, you have stuff to she, give me? Okay. You want to sign up to this. Okay. It says something. I have read through the school rules booklet and discussed with my child. We understand what is expected to have a successful school year. Yep, we have to sign that. Yep. Oh, pink out t-shirts. Yep. All right. Do you have homework today? Just sign your no. rules. No. Did, oh. Did you have any specials today? Yeah. Which and one? then after that, all that was done, we got to have a drink of our water bottles. And then we went to library. And there was, I'm number 17. And the rest of the people had to go in certain orders. Like number order? Like, yeah. Numerical order. Yeah. And then. You um, had library today? Yeah. And then we went down to the hallway, and we almost got tickets because we almost got our tickets took away because Dominic, he was like, <laughs> and then after we got to the library, we sat down and we saw the story that says, mm -hmm. and there's peanut butter and jelly on the book. It looks real, but it's not actually real. And when you flip the page, there was orange juice, crayons, uh, peanut butter, and jelly. I love that book. On each page. And then at the end, he, his voice was squeaky. Oh, was it? And then, once we got the library, <laughs> we got to play this. I got to color. Oh, you got to color? At the library, yeah. you got to color? Back to Back to school. Back to school. You went to the library today, too? Yeah, you guys went to the library at different times. Same with lunch. Wait, so tomorrow <laughs> we will have same, the same special. I don't know, because Jack's on Thursday. He has gym. Remember, remember, you and you and Jack said that. Remember, we saw that on the paper. You and Jack have the same specials every day. So on the days that you have gym, Jack has gym too. On the days that you have library, he has library too. The days that you have music, he has music too. You have the same specials on each day. I know why. Why? Because each grade, so... The uh, preschools don't do reading, but kindergarten, first grade, and third grade, they do the same thing. Can I see and, then, and then fourth grade doesn't do it. Because <laughs> third grade, they still do it. But fourth grade, they don't have anymore. <laughs> fourth graders have specials, don't they? Yeah. So they don't do what anymore? Oh, first grade... <laughs> grade and first grade third grade and first grade they're all together and then uh, <laughs> I think you're just making stuff. I'm not joking <laughs> give me the paper I'll look at the paper different listen different ones have it on different days but it just so happens that second no, grade and can okay it just so happens that second grade and kindergarten are on the same day this is tomorrow no, he has gym Thursday. He doesn't have school tomorrow. Tomorrow's just the girls. And then he goes and then he goes the next day, which is Thursday, and he'll have gym. Why what special do you have tomorrow? Uh I have <laughs> uh, We'll have to look at your paper. Makerspace. Oh, do you? Okay. Oh yeah, because well, yeah, library today. is the the gym oh, follows makerspace. Maker yeah, so there wouldn't Maker be makerspace tomorrow. Oh, yeah, it wouldn't. So yeah, yeah, first, yeah. first <sighs> it's O, and then it's music, and then it's library, and then it's makerspace, and then it's gym. So okay. gym is the first one, and then uh, O is the next one, and music is the next one, and then uh, uh, makers. Wait. 
What's it's okay. It's on, it's on, honey, it's on our paper. Makerspace, gym, art, library, music. <laughs> it's okay. It's on our paper. What happened? There was a raccoon. No, I was wondering if you guys got to walk around the school and find the nurse and the library and all that. And what did oh, you say? I, did. I know. I remember now. I forgot about that. But what did you find? What did you say? Tell mom. And then you can watch your video back so that you remember. Did you say you found a raccoon? Mm -hmm. And you said there's not, to, there's not supposed to be... I don't know. Wait, did you say there's not supposed to be candy at school but a raccoon had some? Yeah. What? What raccoon? You having a snack on the floor? <laughs> All right, Allie's stinky mm -hmm. socks. So what? What happened when you got back to your classroom? Adrian, what happened when you got back to your classroom after you went on a tour? Was a raccoon in your classroom? Jax? Was a raccoon in your classroom? Jackson! She's not filming anymore. Hey, pause it for a second. So when you got back to your classroom, was a raccoon in your classroom? He was? Yeah, but we didn't see it. How do you know he was in your classroom? Because it was candy. He, what? He brought candy to your classroom? He did. What did he bring? Um, what you kisses. What? For everybody? Yeah. Kisses. Was that so cool? Did you have a good first day? Yeah, he won't tell me if I'm recording. Allie and Adri love to tell me everything, but. Okay, so Adri started her morning off by getting on the wrong bus, but that's okay because it stopped and picked him up. Yeah, literally. <laughs> And you got to sit with your friend Nyla, and yeah. you said you guys talked the whole way to school, and it was fun. Yeah, that's my homework line. Do you have a bunch of stops in between here and school? No. Yeah, two. That's it. Yeah, we pick up this girl that I'm friends with, and we pick up my friend named Carly, and then we pick up the people at the apartments. So, anyways, I get to my homeroom. I sit right beside Lucas. Or do you? Mm-hmm. That's okay. You guys, okay, for anyone new, that's her ex-boyfriend. But they still get along. They message nice. each other on Snapchat and stuff. So we just sit there for a minute and we watch this, like, video about back to school or whatever. Oh, wait, did you have a hard time getting in your locker first thing this morning? No. Or did you get it right open? I got it right open. Right beside Lucas? His is right beside yeah. hers, too. <laughs> anyways, so anyways, what the? Anyways, so anyways, yep. So, you I watched videos to, all night? I went to homeroom and then we watched this video that, like, the principals made and everything about like back to school so that was basically just homeroom that's all we did then we went to choir she had us practice some things and we had to like do this thing where like you couldn't say this like sacred verse or something so it was like so me so that's what it was and then you like she would sing one and then she would sing that one and if anyone like sang it then she would get a point and then if we didn't sing if we didn't sing it so like if we did sing it she would get a point if we didn't then we would get a point and we won <laughs> so was that fun yeah mm -hmm. so you got to sing today on your first day and you yeah. nana said sing your heart on you said i don't think we're gonna sing on the first day well, and you didn't um <laughs> did she separate you into like alto soprano no not any, nothing yet she put us in like alphabetical order and then she put like all the girls with a group of girls and the boys with a group of, with a group of boys. Except for me. I was right next to a boy, but she said she'll move me, so it's fine. Um Then But you're in there the with end, Marley and Brielle, right? Yeah. So then at the end of choir, I because we had to go get our stuff out of like the cubby thing in the jig where our stuff is. And then I'm gonna put my feet on this thing. Anyways, so we Got like we went into like the cubby things and got like our school. Stop smiling like that. Oh no, I'm I'm just sitting here. I'm tired. So got, you guys like, had me up late. We got like our school supplies or we got our stuff out of the cubbies. And then Marley was right there, so then me and Marley walked to our next class together. But they moved the life skills room. It's oh, down they by the gym now. So anyways, we had to go down there and we had to sit on the floor because the desks haven't came yet. They're supposed to come by like Friday. Wait, did you and her have life skills together? Yeah, we have life skills together. Oh, do you have all your specials together then? No. For every nine weeks, just this one? My second quarter special and fourth quarter special, like, I have social skills for second and an art for last. Marley has art for second and social skills oh. for last, so those are just switched. But we have gym together also. But you don't have any other teachers? 
Of the same teachers? Just the, those two specials? Jim and... The special. Okay. That's Anyways, cool. So we went to specials. We just did this paper that was like all about me or something. And it said, what do you like to do in your free time? And I said, play volleyball, hang out with friends and family, and watch Bluey. Oh my god. <laughs> so anyways, and then at the end we got to just like talk and play on our Chromebooks because they were like... Oh, talks. so you got your Chromebooks today? Yeah, my little... Did you get and your assignment we... notebook today too then? Yeah, it's like, like literally so tiny. And then we went to language arts. I sit right next to Lucas in that class too, but it's fine. Um, language arts is so fun. My language arts teacher is my favorite, just like last year. Well, co-teacher or whatever. But they're both, they're like, that class is my favorite. They're both tied as my favorite teacher. All right. So, anyways, so was there anybody in either of those classes that you're like, yes, and you were so excited that they were in your class? Not that you really. didn't know was in your class? No. No? No. So anyways, that was fun. It's your dried glue. I picked yeah. some off of the table today, too. I know. So, anyways, we got into language arts, and we just went over, like, some ground rules that are just basic. Allie's day was so much more fun than mine. But it's okay. And then after that, I went to math. And it's the weirdest thing ever, because you go to math, and you're there for, like, I don't know how long. And we just, like, talked about stuff and played a couple games. Like, we played, a, like, a game... To, like, get to know each other better in every single class. So, anyways, we play the game, and then you go to lunch. And you go out the door, and then there's, like, the doors. So, you know how, like, behind where Mr. Cut and all stands, there's, like, that bit, like, that kind of, like, square room. And then oh, yeah, like the doors. yeah, because that's where I would put my yeah. drink when I was there. we go through those doors. Because on the other side of those doors is where Mrs. Wade's classroom is, which is my math teacher. Okay. And then, Allie, Alana's outside waiting for you to come out. Jax must be in the other room playing. I think she's out there by herself. Jax just waiting for Oh, Jax is on the floor, so she's out there waiting for somebody to come out and play. Oh my god. You can take your cookies out there, Allie. And your tablet. So then anyway. I just realized she was still out there. You go to lunch. <laughs> and then you go back to math? Yeah, and then you go back to math. It's, so it's just kind of split. Like you get, like you get your well, stuff. That, and like well, that's nice. It's kind of split up. Yeah. So you get your lunch, you eat it, and then you go back to math. Then we played a couple more games. Then for win, we had to go to this, like, it was like, it was because we were doing, like, this team meeting. That way it was the first one because they do one every month. I also thought they were going to do locker checks every month, which is something new. So I was like, okay. <laughs> and then after that was science and social studies. And that was really fun because Mr. Brown is super funny and super fun. And he went over, like, all the, like, safety precautions and all that did you turn your paper in yeah and then whoa i'm gonna have to scale over the couch what was i gonna tell you you say it's super funny his class is super fun yeah because he just like we had to write down something and then like we had it was like this quote thing and we had to like write down what we thought it meant and we crumbled up the piece of paper because that's what he told us to do and then you just and then you he had a basketball hoop and he held it up and we had to try and throw it in the basketball hoop. And then after that he picked up a couple and like read what they said because we didn't put our names on them. So that was fun. And I had a pack of bluey fruit snacks in my backpack, so I ate those at school. So are you allowed to take a snack? No. You're not? No, I was really hungry. And I didn't have a teacher say anything. Like last year, Miss uh Allie's teacher had her bring a snack, but this year she eats lunch even later, and I don't, they haven't said anything about a snack. They said no gum because last year, um, we had to clean it off a bunch of trays. <laughs> yeah. That. And somebody put it on a chair and somebody sat in it, and then somebody like wiped it under the desk and a bunch of other crap. And then, in choir, I'm just gonna sing this song real quick. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Someone put a whoopee cushion on my teacher's chair. She didn't see it. There. She cried. Oh my. She didn't see it there. And then you like make a horse. That was so funny. Are they guys saying in choir? No, <laughs> wait. I'm do it again. Okay. I'm going to present it to you. Okay. Somebody put a whoopee cushion on my
<laughs> That's what your whole choir did all at the same time? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's how you started your morning? Yes. I mean, it does wake you up a lot. Yeah. Mm. What was for lunch? Mike's cheese bites. Oh, yeah. Who did you stay with at lunch? Kalina and Malia, which is Lucas's new girlfriend. But you guys got along? We're friends, so. You guys get along? Yes, like I said, we're friends. So you, are is it assigned seats or just? No, we can sit wherever we want, but I sit on the whole other side of the room like I thought I would. Like I sit. So you can't really sit wherever you want. You can sit wherever you want out of a certain section. Out of like eight tables. So you can't even sit with Braille at lunch? No, unless you sit at like table 24 when then you can sit with your friends. It has like a peanut free table, so if you sit there you can like sit with your friends, but you're not allowed to peanut butter. So you're not allowed to sit with either of your best friends? No. They should just let you sit wherever you want to. I don't remember that back that far. I know in high school we sit. You sit wherever you want to sit. <laughs> um, There's no section for any grades or anything. In language arts, we had to do this like thing where like we had to separate like what we thought because Mrs. Wade has an assistant teacher. Well, uh -huh. that's not language arts. That's math. Anyways, separate the things that we thought that like were about like one was like I went to Bluffton University. That kind of stuff. So we had to guess which ones were about. Okay, so we did that. And this girl that I never thought would even talk to me because she's one of the popular people and she's so pretty. And I just love her. But anyways, she asked to be my partner and then we worked together and we actually got along really well and that was like the highlight of my day. I loved it. What's her name? Josie. And then- So you made a new friend today? Yeah. <laughs> That's so Yay, sweet. just one? More than that, but. Now, anybody in choir that you became friends with since? No? But I have a lot of friends already, so like. Did you know anybody? Um, or is there a bunch of people that you don't know in your classes, or do you pretty much know no, all of the I seventh know, grade? Like, I know everyone. Except okay. for this one kid, but that's it. Were there any new kids that this was their. Yes. There was this girl named Serenity. I became friends with her, too, because she, like, knew nobody, so I decided that I was going to be her friend because I'm kind like that. And what's what's her last name? I don't know. And it was her first yeah. time going to your school? She's never been... No. Do you know where she moved here from? No. Oh, okay. Okay, it's 6.36. I took a little tiny nap on the couch, and I just kept tomatoes. Uh, brought up some burger for tacos. Don't mind, that's Jay playing guitar. Well, then you're making dinner after it worked. Anyway, I've got some cheese, sour cream, guacamole... Tomatoes, I'm gonna cut up some onion and then I'm gonna make tacos. And then after we eat, I gotta pack up Jack's and take him to my mom's so he can spend the night at my mom's because he doesn't have school tomorrow. Tomorrow's just the kindergarten girls. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to hurry up. All right, soft taco for Jack's, taco salad for Allie. Adri is making some quesadilla type thing. There's guacamole, I already have a guacamole cup out if you want that. All right, Allie, come sit at your table. Jaxie, come sit at your table. I know you're tired. You can eat, then I'll take you to Nana's, okay? And you can hang out with just you and Nana. Dad, I thought you were taking us to Dollar Tree. So, let's get dinner going. That's it. Hi, so I just made a big soft taco with sour cream, meat, the Mexican cheese blend, lettuce, onion, tomato, and Taco Bell mild sauce. And that's my dinner. On Tuesday, August 20th. Oh, I had like four of the... the heck? Hang on a second, honey. Oh, what are they? Peanut butter pie Oreos. So I had a couple of those uh, while I started making dinner. Other than that, the only thing I have was the lunch from school today that I showed in an eating video. Okay, so I just had a couple strawberries with some of this ready whip or whatever it is. Aldi brand. Um, I stopped at Walmart, like I took Jax to my mom's. I made tacos, we had tacos, I took Jax to my mom's. And while the girls were there telling my mom about their day, sorry, I'm, there's nowhere to put you right here. I ran uh, to the store, because Adrian wanted these sausage patties for breakfast. And while I was there, I saw that they had Sour Patch Kids and it said Big Kids. So I don't know if I looked away or what as I was grabbing them, but I got to my mom's, I took them out of the bag, so excited to see what they were, if they are like giant Sour Patch Kids, and I'm like, what the hell? I'm like, this just says Sour Patch Kids. I'm like, I swear it said big on the bag. 
I'm trying to look it up and see if I'm losing my mind if they really make big uh, Sour Patch Kids and I just grabbed the wrong one. Like I'm so I want to open it. I want to go exchange it for the big ones because I'm like, I was intrigued by it. Cause I'm like, oh, I love Sour Patch Kids. If they make big ones, that'd be so good. But yeah, I, there's nowhere on here does it say big. So I don't know. I'm overly tired. So yeah, we're just, it is 10.03, way past bedtime. Adrian's finishing a snack. Allie's finishing her. She's already in jammies. And once we all get in bed, we're going to crash. So yeah. And I also have whipped cream with strawberries and blackberries. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Oh, part of the stem. Just set it right here. There's my stem. Yeah. How's your tooth? Still wiggly? Mm -hmm. Still in there? Is it? Mm -hmm. I know, it's so loose. All right, go finish your snacks. We can get in bed. It's super late. We've got to be getting in bed by like nine at the latest. But we weren't even home at nine. That was a successful first day of school. Now, Allie, tomorrow she'll walk into school by herself since Jax doesn't have school because tomorrow's just the kindergarten girls. But yeah, six a. We were in the car and it was nine thirty, and I'm like, Adrian, I'm like, you have to get up for school in eight and a half hours. I'm like, we're not even home yet. I'm like, that just sounds so crazy. And she's like, well, I said, well, from ten to six is eight hours. I said it's nine thirty, so it's a half hour away from ten. So I need to go upstairs and do my skincare. I'm still in my work clothes. And get ready for bed. I don't have to get re dressed before I take Allie to school so I can pick out my clothes after I take her to school. And then tomorrow when they're both home, after her and Adri both get home, we'll go get Jax. He's going to go with my mom to her physical therapy appointment. She had me bring his tablet and he took Woody and the alien and Forky. <laughs> and yeah, now I'm just rambling so I'm going to go get in bed. I'm so tired. Actually, I lied. Last night I ate a donut and then um where's this at i ate a donut and then a bunch of cheeses before bed and it like sat heavy on my stomach that was like super late so like right now it's 10 o'clock i'm still kind of hungry so i'm gonna have i haven't had this in a while a banana with strawberry whipped cream whitney got me turned on to this that was like her pregnancy craving I mean, like, these don't want to come out. If you haven't had strawberry whipped cream, well, I haven't tried this one. We, oh, yeah, it is. It's a great value. I've had that one. If you haven't had the strawberry uh, whipped cream on bananas, it's so good. Be better than a donut. So I'm gonna have this and then I'm gonna go upstairs and go to bed. I'm filming. You knew what I was gonna say. No, I'm just before you say anything foul language or anything, I'm letting you know I'm filming. I need to look up and see if they make the big kids. <laughs> These bananas are too ripe for me. I find bananas still green. These already have brown spots. Where's the nutty buddies? Eat a banana. Eat a banana with strawberry whipped cream. These are just overly ripe, so they're too sweet. This is how my dad liked them. Just give me a bite. I don't want any more. I ate half the banana. Good, yeah. All right, okay. I was getting ready to go to bed, and or at least head upstairs. I have a pickle, kosher dill spear. There's only a couple left. <sighs> Jack is like me, he loves pickles. I 
I just like to put the air on 68 like I do every night and it won't come on. And here in a couple days, it's supposed to get back up in the high 80s. Got the dishes done. This is fresh green beans from my stepdad's garden. I knew Allie was tired. She wasn't in her bed five minutes and she was out. As a kid, my babysitter would pour some in a cup what? and let me drink it. All right, I'm ready to head upstairs now. Have my pickle, I'm good. If I eat anything else, I'll let you know. I shouldn't though, I should just get in bed. But I'm, am I hungry or snacky or just? I don't know.